These are flies. Well, actually, they're ants, but you know what? It's close enough. And if you don't think it's close enough, and you know, my buddy Henry the Hitman, well, you know, he'll make things close enough if you catch my drift. But yeah, let's get back on topic. Flies are kind of like phantoms. And honestly, a lot of other flying insects are a lot like phantoms, too. I mean, even birds are kind of like phantoms. I mean, just look at pigeons. Pigeons are the stuff of nightmares. Pigeons just give me the willies, man. I don't like pigeons. Pigeons are creepy. Besides carrier pigeons, carrier pigeons are lit. And if you don't like carrier pigeons, then, like, I don't understand, man. Like, just look at these words. They carry mail. And they deliver it in wars. Carrier pigeons are legit heroes. And I will not take any carrier pigeon slander here. But yeah, this intro's gone on for far too long. So it's time for me to explain the science behind why phantoms are Minecraft's most annoying mob. So the first thing I want to do is analyze the phantom's attack pattern. So the attack that the phantom uses is that it flies into you. Then it flies back up. And then it flies into you again. Now here's the kicker. This reminds me of flies and mosquitoes, and here's why. So with my experience, bugs like to fly into my nose a lot. Spoiler alert, this is actually incredibly annoying because you're worried that you have a bug stuck up your nose, and that's not a very nice thing to think about. Also, because it's very, very itchy, which is very, very annoying. And I think I said annoying like seven times in the same sentence, but I digress. But to simplify things, the reason why phantoms are so annoying is because they're too similar to bugs. For example, the conditions in which a phantom can spawn. For a phantom to spawn, you must have not died or slept for free in-game days. This this reminds me of fruit flies. The reason why this reminds me of fruit flies is because fruit flies congregate to eat the fruit in your kitchen that you left out. Much like how phantoms congregate when you don't sleep. You see the similarities there? Also, why am I saying congregate so much? Like, no one actually says that in real conversation. Anyway, because of this, fruit flies are a complete nuisance. Speaking of which, I have like, a bunch of flies flying around my desk right now. Little buggers. But just three shots from kitchen gun. <laughs> And that is how you eliminate the causes of problems. I learned that in social studies. That was also a joke. Do not take that seriously. If you want to get rid of flies, use like a napkin or a fly's water or something. Don't actually use a gun. Like, please, please don't, man. Like, all right, why don't we get on topic again? I feel like we're always like, you know, getting off topic this video. Like, yeah. And um, yeah, I'm totally not doing that because I want to increase watch hours. <laughs> yeah, I would never do something like that. I'm, I'm an honest, just man, you know what I mean? Anyway, another reason why phantoms are so annoying is that it's just not worth it to kill them. Like, the only thing that they drop is a phantom membrane, which is just not that good. I mean, the only thing you can do with it is repair your elytra. And also, repairing your elytra with a phantom membrane is stupid expensive. Like, the game literally says it's too expensive. Now, if I translate too expensive in Minecraft terms to USD, you know what you get? You get, like, seven million dollars. And no, no, there's a million exchange rate for this. I just made that up. But for the purpose of this video, he is just talking math, I don't worry, you know what, forget about this. Anyway, the point of this segment is just that it's so expensive to go and repair your elytra with a phantom membrane. But I mean, you only really have a couple of alternatives. You can get mending, or you can just go and get another elytra from the end, which is very painful. But it's not as painful as killing phantoms. I'm joking, it, it definitely is. I mean, it is the most annoying mob in Minecraft. Endermen are pretty annoying, but they're not that annoying, you know what I mean? If you're not an idiot and you wear a pumpkin on your head, which is not really just not being an idiot, it's more of me being a wimp then, you know, you don't have to deal with that issue. Speaking of being a wimp, you better vote Glare, because I want peace of mind while I'm mining, because I'm a wimp. Please vote Glare, even though it might be the most useless one there for most of you guys, but let's be real. Do you want to bow down to the evil redstone community of Minecraft? But the thing is, by the time this video is published, Minecons probably have already happened, and Fuzz the mob vote has happened, so this is probably pretty irrelevant anyway. Also, can we bring up the fact that we voted for the Phantom? Like, we literally sat down, saw what the Phantom was, and we were like, oh yeah, this is a great choice, let's vote for it. Like, what was going through our heads at that moment, I honestly have no idea myself. Okay guys, I'm afraid but that's going to be the end of this video. I should have more videos like this coming out in the near future, so subscribe if you want to see those. I mean, you're gonna be able to see them anyway, but you, you get the idea, you get the idea. Anyway, see you guys later.